Okay, I've got a Morris Rubra seedling. Um, I'm going to attempt to do a inverted T-bud graft of this Black Prince Scion. I've got several buds to work with here, so let's go ahead and pull this out of the pot so we uh, can work a little bit lower. Got some roots growing out the bottom. This would be a little tricky. This is a pretty small diameter to try and do the inverted T-bug, but we're going to give it a shot, see what happens. Um, let's go as low as we can here. There we go. We'll go halfway around. I'll peel that back. And it's going to rock my blade, walk it up a little bit, walk, rock it again. Okay, I'm going to very carefully try and get that bark. All right, so far so good. Very gently get underneath that bark. Okay, so far so good. So we're going to take a bud here off the scion. I think we'll do this one right here. And for this one, I'm going to remove the wood because it's such a small rootstock. There we go, the cut about a little more than halfway. We'll come in at a 45 and then just kind of rock up and let the wood split down towards that first cut. We oh my goodness. So let's go ahead and try and remove this wood. So just very gently and careful not to damage the bud on the other side, but very gently get between the bark and the wood. And there we go. Hopped right out. Not to touch that too much, and then we have our bud. And all right, okay. All right, you can slide that up, pops right in there. All right. Go ahead and wrap that in some buddy tape. And then just to hold everything tight, I'll put a couple zip ties. And there we have it, an inverted T-bud graft of a black prince on a Morris Rubra seedling. That uh, should keep it from restricting the growth. Let's get a closer look here. All right, we'll check back in a couple weeks.